Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Rogue Tech Cold Forged. So today we're going to go against the Two Skull Star Adderan uh, clan mission. It's uh, Heavy Lance was inserted into the planet's surface right here. Um, let's see what we can get down on this. Uh, let's go to negotiate this contract out. We're going to go full salvage. We've got plenty enough uh, sea bills to make our um, financial report. Plus we've got a little bit, a little bit less left over if we have to get some repairs done on this one, which I'm probably thinking we may have to depending on how it plays out. But let's pull out our second lance. At the end of this episode too, we're going to try and uh, fit up the uh, the new Wolverine and the old Wolverine, get them back into service. So let's bring in the Zeus, the Catapult, the Warhammer, and the Shadowhawk. And we're going to go with our standard lance. Uh, cold Metal, we're going to get Hickory, and then we're bringing in Riddler again, and Pylon and the Shadowhawk. Let's deploy this sucker and get it done. All right, here we go. We've got some good cover here. Serious resistance, yeah, I know. Ugh, I heard vehicles moving. Chances are we got reinforcements, so... I don't know, it's a pretty small battlefield, maybe not. Nope, looks like it's a one-on-one. -on -one. This, I think, is the first time I've actually played on this map. That's interesting. Interesting indeed. Okay, Pylon, let's, let's get our job done. Let's get up here. I'm gonna hide. Hopefully detect some more of these guys. They're all on this side. Still unknown. Alright. You can expect heavy resistance. Oh, of course. Open my stupid mouth. Epona. Okay, cool. We get some good stuff off this guy. Um, dude, you're like prey for Hickory. Yeah. Copy that. That's not even like a, not even a thunderbolt shot. That's just one of these. I thought it was gonna miss there for a second. I thought it was gonna hit the st the rock here. Oh, we got lucky. Okay. Well, not lucky. I mean, it was an 80% chance to hit, but still, I felt like we got lucky. Waiting for orders. Can we get anybody in sight? No, we cannot. So, let's be careful here. Let's move. What we're going to do is we're going to push ourselves forward. Um, because this map is very, very small, we want to be able to pull back to this rock. This is kind of our last bastion of hope. So, as long as we um, move forward and claim some of the ground, eh, I think if we go here, we're going to be targeted. Let's at least go here. If we can claim some forward ground, then when they come forward, at least they'll be in the open here. We can target them, and then if worst case scenario, we can all pull back and still have some more cover. I think these vehicles, though, they got to go first. We've got to get rid of these guys fast, and then we can just deal specifically with the mechs. They are lighter vehicles, so let's What's see if we can get eyes on pylon. Please and thank you. Okay, there's two there that we can probably kill. He says before he finds out what they really are. Scorpion. Yeah, that's a one-hit wonder. And the Zora is a one-hit wonder for both of these for the... Uh, for um, Hickory. So let's fire. Firing. No luck. Okay, so they've got two heavies. Two heavy mechs and an assault mech, most Great likely. Um, we're going to just walk over here. I think we're probably safe. Targeting this guy. Um, how's our heat? Zero, so we're going to fire everything. Wow. Okay, nice. That guy's done. Make that one less vehicle. So we're going to reserve Hickory. And the reason why we're going to do that is I don't want to waste the arrow rounds on a vehicle unless I absolutely have to. Yeah, good luck with that, buddy. 
Although he's not as, anywhere near as evasive as um, Recoil was in the in the um, in the uh, Phoenix Hawk. I think this guy doesn't have an NSS. That's why. Probably why. Okay, let's get it in the trees just in case that assault. They got a heavy guy that reserved back there too. So just in case that guy doesn't see us. Uh, what we got here for armor? Crap tons. Let's do a multi-target here. And I think we'll go this route. We might get lucky and kill B with just these. Okay, nice. The AC 20 hit. Nah, we're not going to kill this guy. But we can soften him up for Hickory with the uh, Thunderbolt. Might be enough with just the Thunderbolt on this guy. Mm, uh, nope. It won't be. Not unless we get lucky. Oops. Yep. It's multi target. Let's go. Ah. Forget it. This is dumping both on A. One ninety four and sixty. Wow. So this is one side that's crippled. Oh man. At least it's only two damage a pop. What did you just say? Stop something or other? Stop that tickles? Okay, light vehicle. Wow. Nice shooting, Tex. Uh, okay. Let's reserve. Roger that. Standing by. Okay. I'm here. Rolling. I want to make sure we're seeing the front of this guy. And we'll fire everything on him. Okay, we got the side we wanted. That should do it, I think. Yep. This is what happens when you hang out with bad people. It is. Yeah, they still got eyes on. But so do we. Yeah. That should do it, I think. Okay. Good thing they were all vehicle reinforcements. And I got three mechs left. Okay, there's our stability back. The assault mech is up on the flank, I think. Oh, there's three heavies. They had an assault. I guess they must have reserved. That's probably what it was. Now, how do we want to approach this? I know exactly what we're going to do. Okay, so if you look at the terrain here, when you're when you're engaging like any kind of units like this, you got three across here. But the terrain is this way, right? These rocks are blocking like that. Like everything kind of blocks along a plane like this. So if we move in behind here, this guy's the only guy that's really going to be able to see us between these two. We can target him and kill him fast and then deal with these two guys afterwards. That's my plan. Whether it works or not, I don't know. But that's the thought anyway. So the first thing we want to do is this. We want to give him somebody to target. Oh, they got another guy back here too, so they do have four. Gonna go Phantom Mech on this one, and then we're just gonna target this guy and fire. Reporting negative damage. 
It's okay. We're trying to suck him in. And you've done that. Thank you. Wow. Good targeting, man. Okay. I await your command. Double time. Let's go. Let's confirm the warlord. Really great chances to hit. Now, um, I think we're just going to fire straight out, see if we can open up something and give us some opportunity. Okay. Yep. Mm. Zeus is going to have to go around the other way. I think we're going to have a hard time getting a uh, target on this guy. Ammo for everything. Let's fire. I'm taking the shot. Nice. Missed with the uh, Thunderbolt, though. Okay. We can hit him from here. That's fine. Unstable. We only hit him with the AC-20? Wow. I guess so. Can't even hit him with the AC-20. No damage detected. Oh well. Okay. Waiting for orders. What do we got left in the leg here? 60. So PPC's hit away of, from dying. What do we want to do here? We could attempt just to knock this guy down. He goes on turn two. So let's... Do this. I mean, we're not getting total protection here, but it's enough protection. I'm gonna push you back. Try a CT hit and just fire. Got it. Oh, we hit him. Nice. Doesn't matter though. Pushed him back a turn. He's going on turn one now, which means he's got Warhammer and uh, Catapult to worry about. What do you need? Uh, I'm gonna start off with the Warhammer first. Ready. We're only gonna walk. Save some heat and save some accuracy, and we're going to dump everything. Whew. We need this guy off the map board. Let's try and do this. Okay, he's going down. Perfect time to use Warlord. Gonna go for a CT hit and fire. There we go. Gotcha. You did. Good work. We're gonna get an early target on this guy, I think. Now he's braced and he's got 50% decrease in damage so we're just going to plink him. I'm not going to bother using Warlord just yet on him. Okay. Receiving you. Roger. 
Got to be very careful with this guy now. But we're going to push this guy back a turn again. He's just standing there not doing anything. That's fine. You play the game like that, we'll show you how to play the game. That's a lot of missiles. Yep. Nope. I live to serve. So this one, we got a guy back here. So you really want to angle yourself back over this way. So where that guy can't see you, but you can still fire on our, your target. Right? Just making it harder for them. And we're going to dump everything into this guy. I'm going to leave all four mediums off this time. We don't really need them at this point, but we'll use them all next time. Okay, a bit of stability. What do you need? Can you target him from here? You can't. You can from there. If you want to step out, though, that's the question. That's the Thunderbolt side, so I think we're probably okay. And we'll fire straight on this guy. Five rounds left, four rounds left. Wow, that was a really bad hit. Still not unstable either, which is uh, disconcerting here. Okay, I guess gonna fire on him again. Nice. All right. Enemy Finally got through the side. If he had been in the open and shot before we had done this to him, he would have been in big trouble. He would have been dead before that, probably. Yeah. Pick it on the spotter now, are you? Don't blame you. Where are you going? All right, fair enough. I'm receiving you. I'm walking here. Put all those guys on. Target this guy, fire everything. Yeah. That's all right. He shut down. Can't sprint. Can move to here. Move. Gonna leave the arrow off. We don't need it for this guy. Oh. Let's reserve again. Let's force their guy to move. I guess they're not. Okay, pylon. You need to get me eyes on, buddy. It's a horrible task. Oh, we can't get eyes on the guy up here. You're going to be going twice. Confirmed. Okay, there we go. I like it when they shut down. That's another archer, it looks like. Uh, archer clan. Alright, well. What do you think, guys? Try to knock his head off with the AC-20? Why not? 
Yeah, well. Oh, we got a head hit, though. Ready for orders. Gotta make sure we're not anywhere where that other guy can see us. Targeting this guy. Gonna go for head hits again. Okay, getting up into here. He hasn't moved. Let's warlord it again. Because we can save some heat, fire everything. Firing on target. Maybe we can get a knockdown here somewhere. Yeah. Keep her behind this rock. Arrow it up. Targeting. Um, do we want to go for... Um, it's a lot of LRM ammo in that torso. We could do an offensive push, but I think we just fire straight out. Well, there you go. Pilot lethal damage. Hit him right in the head. They got a hundred tonner back there. Is he stuck off them? He's not stuck. He's just sitting there. No idea what it is. Let's get into the forest here. I want us all in positions that we can uh, yes, Commander. take advantage of this guy. For the right He's not doing anything. He's waiting for us. Thing is, is he can't move, I don't think, and see any of us. So that's why he's not doing anything. Gonna let him go first. He's gotta move now. He's not moving. Commander. Okay, we can get eyes on and get out. Double time. Let's go. Stone Rhino. Guy's made of stone, all right. I'll give him that, that's for damn sure. All right, let's just start this off. Confirm. Jesus Christ. Let's get right in his face. Hopefully that's gonna negate his, his um, Goss rifles. It could be a crack pilot, but um, we got a really great chance to hit. Let's offensive push his head. Yeah. Got it. Okay, what's our chance to hit here? Pretty good. Gonna take it. Let's warlord this sucker up. Drop some shiz on this guy. Sixty-seven only. I'm your spaniel. He's braced. There's not much I can do about it. All these guys are going before him again next turn, so I'm not worried about moving them straight in. Uh, we're gonna do an offensive push on him. Gonna try for that headshot again and fire. Roger that. There's the knockdown. <sighs> okay. Standing by. On the move. Full speed. I want to try and take this guy's head off. Where are you here, buddy? There you are. Wait, why can't I attack you? 
What the hell? Is he behind a rock? Are you kidding? Why does it say he has no internal structure? Yep. Uh what? Is he actually dead? Okay, I'm gonna save this and come back. Hang on a minute. Okay, I'm going to quit out and uh, come back in, and maybe this guy can be targeted again? I have no idea what's going on here. So uh, give me a second, I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I guess we ended up killing him. This is what, we got, this is what it came to anyway. I guess we killed him somehow. I have no idea how. The only thing I can think of, maybe there was a bug with his armor or something. Maybe he had, like, I don't know, composite structure or something. Let's hope we get something in the loot screen. If this actually loads here. Alright, guys, this is the third time reloading this. Um, I can't seem to get through to the salvage screen. So, I don't know why it won't let me get through. So it goes to this screen and then just sits here forever. So if I don't get anything within the next, I don't know, five minutes or so, um, we'll just have to redo the mission. I'm going to just, I'll post this one anyway, just so people can see how it was done. But um, I'll redo the mission after this in the next episode. And, you know, hopefully this doesn't happen again. Not sure exactly what happened with that uh, um, with that stone rhino having zero internal structure. Maybe that's why he couldn't move. I don't know. But, um, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to let this run for five minutes. And if nothing happens, then, you know, we're going to end the episode here. If you like it, drop a like. Otherwise, you know, we'll... Uh, see you at the next screen. If not, we'll see you next episode. <laughs>